the night tube. He yells something at me, partly inaudible, slurred, but no doubt an attempt at a show of prowess. It moves from, you all right, darling? Give us a smile then. I turn around with confidence as I yell back something smart and witty to make his boys coo at my cleverness. He got told, they yell at him. But he still raises his voice, he still shouts profanities at me as I descend the escalator and I turn around with a smile and my middle finger held high in defiance. I exude confidence. What he doesn't see is my lower lip tremble as my head drops to the floor and then drops of water cascade down my face. Why? I'm not sure, but my shaking hand wipes away tears from my face as I tell myself to be strong. Fire fills my chest as I want to shout at that prick, make him feel how I feel as I let the words penetrate and permeate in my brain. Or do they? I mean, they're empty threats now. The more you hear them, the more numb you become, but each one is an ice pick chips away bit by bit, and even when you think no words can hurt you, your shield is invincible, you've built your armour so thick that no arrow can move through it, one will still get past it, hit you in the eye like old King Howard we heard so much about when we were little, and then tears still trickle down your face when you remember the names you were called in the playground for not giving him a kiss, and still the ones you were called when you did, and that man... With eyes like eyes who probably voted for Brexit, believe in Britain, <laughs> sipping on his tin, <laughs> laughing at the thrill of making some girl on the night tube feel uncomfortable. When will it end? When your daughter grows up to receive the same treatment, is that it? Or will you even be woke enough to realise it? Think of all the women in your life who've heard these words directed at them, aimed like the bow of a gun at their forehead, but instead of a bullet, the weapons are even more dangerous. They're words. They don't need the use of a bullet. And they create more than just bullet wounds. They form ideas, and ideas are bulletproof. Thanks.